Valencia was, quite honestly, up until now, the best four months of my life. My experience was very positive overall. Uh, I really highly recommend it. Uh, it was one of the best decisions I've made in my college career, I'd have to say. What I liked about Valencia was uh, there was a lot of cool architecture, firstly, uh, and really a city for a lot of art. There was a lot of you know, museums, really cool art and architecture. My overall experience uh, in Valencia has been amazing, from being able to go to the beach within 10 minutes, to the city, both the old town and new town, uh, taking both engineering classes and Spanish classes at two different campuses. It's been really unique. One of my favorite things I like to do in Valencia is run around the city because everything is so beautiful and there's so much greenery and foliage to run around and look at so you never get bored. What I enjoy most about studying abroad is immersing myself in a different culture and getting to socialize in a different way, learning different customs, um, meeting new friends, learning from other people, seeing what else there is in the world other than what we already know. We take all our engineering courses in the morning at La Universidad Politecnica de Valencia. Um, they're all concentrated within the same building. Uh, basically in the morning you'll take classes from anywhere from like 8.30 to 3 and then you go back to your host family, have lunch, you have a break, and then your uh, Spanish classes are in the afternoon uh, at the studio center. Speaking Spanish, it's a little difficult uh, just because I hadn't taken Spanish in a while, but within a week I felt like I was assimilated. I didn't really have a problem whatsoever after that. This class, they participate a lot. They ask so many questions, they want to know everything, so for me as a teacher, I'm really happy with them. All the engineering courses are taught in English. And uh, all the Spanish courses obviously are taught in Spanish in our center. Engineering students come to this building. They are not allowed to speak in English. During the fall semester, the high moments are the Camino de Santiago, which is a pilgrimage that we do the last 180 miles from Onferrada, a small town in Castile, to Santiago de Compostela, which is our final destination, and is the place that the, the St. James is buried. And also we have the one day that we get together with all the students, we go to cook paella on the mountains. That's very nice because we get together and we get more close relationship with the students and faculty and everyone else. Today we're at a Dia de Paella and we're, we got to like learn how to make paella and do some more hiking and hang out with friends from the school. Um, I take the bus every day. I take number 29, it's called EMT, uh, really convenient. They also have this app called EMT Valencia where you can look at your bus stop and all the times are listed when they come. So I never miss my bus. I tend to get around Valencia walking for the most part because I'm rather close to the center and the Politecnica. But um, on my lazy days, yes, I will take the, the bus or if I'm going to um, a different part of Valencia, I'll take the metro. My method of getting to schools, a lot of times, depending on how I feel, I'll take like a Valen BC, uh, which is a bike rental program, uh, to the train station, which is like a five minute walk from my house usually. But if I'm running late, I'll take, take the bike there. And then I take um, the streetcar to the school, which is, it's, it's only four stops. A lot of times it takes me like 15 minutes to get to the, the school. Oh, the engineering course has been great. Um, the, the instructors are great. They, they're, they're experts in their field, which is amazing. And they're also really great in English, so there's not much of a language barrier between any of them. Um, the engineering education is, is pretty fantastic. Classes that I'm taking are computer science, physics, um, uh, differential equations, uh, physics lab, and then my Spanish course um, at the center. My students uh, follow a basic course of ordinary differential equations where we see all the theory uh, about these very interesting topics on mathematics. I am enjoying my courses. Um, they're more difficult than I expected, but still, um, we're learning a lot and the professors are great. 
teaching international students is, for me, as a professor, a way of learning. Uh, they came with different backgrounds and they came with uh, different methodologies, different, different uh, learning attitudes, and then you have to modify your way of teaching in order to adapt them. The development of the UBA program at UPB in the last two years, because it's very recent, has been uh, really impressive because obviously it began with a short number of students, which has been growing steadily, exponentially, I would say, uh, semester after semester. I've met people from other programs that are joining our UVA program here in Valencia. I've met a girl from Arizona State and I've met a girl from Texas. During fall and spring semesters, uh, maybe we have 60% students from UVA and the rest from other universities. We have a total approximately of over 300 families, host families here in Valencia. Something special regarding engineering students is that we try to place students very close to the UPB center and to our center. If I had a message to send to UVA students on campus, I would say that if you have an opportunity to study abroad, definitely do it. It's very worthwhile. You're gonna feel like you're missing out on stuff back at UVA because we all have special traditions, but it's really very worth it because you get to travel around different places you've never been before in Europe and you get to meet new people and see things from a different cultural perspective. Studying abroad has been such a huge part of my life. This is my third time doing it and each time I've become more independent and both times where I was in Valencia, my Spanish has improved so much and it's made me more confident in everything that I do. One message I have for all the students back at UVA in engineering is that if you're even thinking about coming to Valencia, just go ahead and do it because there's no experience like it. This is not a big city, which means that you can walk the city just almost everywhere within a short period of time. It's a lot of history, a lot of cultural life, a lot of monuments to watch. Beaches are beautiful. The, and the people are very, very honest and open. So it's a good place to, to study, to relax, and to enjoy life.